Three and a half years ago, on a very busy street in the city centre, I was knocked over by a small vehicle and I died of my injuries. As you're looking at me now, you're looking at a dead man. As I was lying there, dead, all I could think about was my wife, my beautiful wife, and how she'd remember me. When she found me porn stash. I was going to throw them out, I swear to God I was. Why well, didn't I? It's kind of what being dead's all about, really, you know. You're completely powerless. When you first die, you shout and you scream and you jump around and nobody takes a blind bit of notice of you. And you're like, hello, hello, but nothing. It's really difficult, you know. It's not nice being ignored by everybody. Absolutely everybody, you know. It's such a surreal experience. Wait till you try it. So many old people, you know, knocking around. Well, it stands to reason, you know. Some of them, in fact, most of them, don't even know they're dead. They're just wandering around endlessly. Just like they did before. Those first few months were tough, you know. But you get used to it. Like you get used to anything, I suppose. It's just about wasting time. Finding things to do, you know. I go for long walks. Yeah, I go for long walks. Uh, go around town. Have a look at some of the things I might have bought myself. Go to the pictures sometimes. Go to the pictures quite a lot. Yeah, me mate Jay, he's often there. All right, Jay. Well, that's something I found out, right? If there's no one in the cinema, show the film anyway. It's like if a tree falls in the forest and there's no one there to hear it, does it make a sound? Y the answer is yes. They still show the film. Do you get that analogy? Don't matter. Some people are under the impression that when you die, you get certain powers, like being able to walk through walls, etc. Well, let me just tell you that that is bollocks. You can't do any of them things. In fact, the opposite is true. You can't open doors. You're powerless. You're living by your nerves. Closing time is a big worry, you know, shops, pubs, things like that. You do not want to get trapped, you know. I was trapped in a woman's toilets for two weeks once. Two long weeks. You might ask what I was doing inside a, a, a lady's toilets, but you, you've got to get some thrills, you know. You've got to do something, you know. We go to bereavement counselling, sort of a restart thing. There's counsellors from up there. And you have to go every single two weeks, otherwise, you know, you're in trouble. Well, on your red beard if you don't. You think about missing it sometimes, you think, oh God, do I have to go there again? Well, there are two places to go, aren't there? And if you don't go up, there's only one place to go and nobody wants to go there. I've heard some horrific stories. So every two weeks, bereavement counselling, I'm there on the button, signing in, you know. Don't you worry about that. That's Mike. I'm just frozen to the spot, gawping at this thing. He got killed by a BMW. Fucking BMW, come. It's hit me that way, just sort of... He's very proud about that. Mike's recently deceased, you see. And they're strange, you see, when, when, you, when, you, when you first die, well, you're full of beans. You're trying to impress, aren't you, you know? But you'll soon learn, you know. Give him a year. I'm fucking famous. Hit by a beer. Give him a year. Who else is there? There's one girl called Michelle, and uh, she's a nice girl, very attractive. She's a suicide, though, so... She demands a lot of attention. But she's lovely, you know, and I'll persevere. 
it takes time, these things, doesn't it, you know? A bit of friendship, you know? I've been dead three and a half years now. I, hey, there's no, uh, there's no time scale about this. It's different for everybody, you know? Some people move on straight away, within months, I've seen it. Other people, four years, seven years. There's people here 70 years. I don't know. I mean, I'll get, I'll get the nod. No problem, yeah. That's, that's how I passed on. Thanks. Thanks, Mike. Uh, Brendan, perhaps you could tell Mike your story. Brendan? 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 Martin, let's move on to you. Uh, why don't you tell Mike about your accident? What type of car was it you were hit by? It was a car. Right, yes. What type of car? A car. Yes. Right. What kind? A car. A car? You mean like a Ford car? You got hit by a Ford car? A fucking Ford car? <laughs> oh, sorry, I'm, I'm sorry about that, mate. I'm... How are things going, Martin? My funeral. I couldn't attend, you know. Far too soon after the event. I'm getting my head round it, to be honest with you. It's a shame, you know, because I'd love to have given myself a good send off. Said goodbye to my wife, you know, and parents and that. Couldn't do it. Couldn't attend. My wife did move on quite quickly after my departure. She found a new man, John. You know, they seem very happy. She's actually pregnant. She's with child, which is nice. Nice for them. I'm just devastated to think that she found that porn, you know, that filthy stuff that I was looking at. Because she was really grieving for me. And then she comes across all that, you know. Shaven Haven, I mean. Such a dickhead. There's been some talk recently that I might be on my way up, you know. Barbara, a friend of mine, used to work in a bookies right, so she's got amazing intuition. And she told me, you know, she says, I think you're on the way up, son, she says. I feel I've, uh, I've, served, I've served my time, you know, I've kept my nose clean, I've been a good lad. I have served. I've served my time. But it didn't happen, did it? It turns out there's only one person allowed to go up, and guess who got it? So I've been knocked back again. I believe that Mike as well. Such a wanker. If people like him are gonna get up there, you know what I mean? And maybe I don't wanna go. Maybe I don't wanna go. What's the problem? What is the problem? Well, why am I still here? Why am I? Why am I still here? I don't know. Think about it quite a lot, you know. 